In another sign of dark clouds gathering over troubled crypto platform Voyager Digital, the U.S. Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation, FDIC, and the board of the Federal Reserve, Fed, America's central bank, have issued a joint letter in which they demand that the company cease and desist from making. The two institutions said in a statement that Voyager and certain officers and employees of the company have made various statements online in which they claimed or suggested that the business is FDIC insured, its customers would obtain the FDIC insurance coverage for all funds provided to and help. Based on the information gathered to date, it appears that these representations likely misled and were relied upon by customers who place their funds with Voyager and do not have immediate access to their funds. Some, however, suggested that this action may be too little, too late. Hindsight is an investor protection, argued Ma Yazahabi, founder and CEO at Stealthy New Venture and founding board member of the Israeli Blockchain Industry Forum, who asked, isn't the whole idea of regulators to point out misleading marketing fluff to investors before companies go under? The it's a low ball bid dressed up as a white knight rescue, Voyager's lawyers said in response to the bid in a recently submitted court filing. Earlier this month, Voyager Digital filed voluntary petitions for relief under Chapter 11 of the United States Bankruptcy Code as it seeks to implement its reorganization plan and maximize value for all stakeholders. Learn more, Voyager Digital Files for Chapter 11, seeks to maximize value for a